Hey guys, so today I'm going to be reading The Zebra Who Was Sad, but it has a, happy, a very happy ending. The Zebra Who Was Sad. Zebra was feeling very, very sad. His best friend Giraffe was moving to the other side of the jungle. They wouldn't be able to play together anymore. I'll miss you so much, said Zebra. I'll miss you too, said Giraffe. I promise to write to you. But Zebra didn't want letters. He wanted his best friend to stay nearby. When Giraffe left, Zebra cried and cried. Cheer up, said his dad. You can still visit Giraffe. But what if Giraffe makes new friends and doesn't want to be her best friend anymore? Zebra couldn't feel happy at all. The other animals wanted to stop Zebra feeling sad. They tried to cheer him up, which is very kind of them. Come and play chase with us, said Cheetah Cub. Zebra joined the game. He tried to have fun, but he kept thinking about his best friend. Giraffe loves playing chase, he said. I wish she was here. Come and play catch, said Little Monkey. They played with bunches of berries. Zebra caught some berries on his back. Everyone cheered and shouted his name. Zebra felt a little bit better. After the game, they shared the berries. They were ripe and juicy. Yum, yum. Giraffe loves berries, said Zebra. He felt sad that he had been having fun without her. Let's play hide and seek, said Snake. It was Zebra's turn to seek. He looked everywhere for his friend. You can see him looking under leaves. <gasps> Little Elephant was easy to find. Found you! And you can see why. Big old elephant. Hippo hid in the muddy river. He pretended to be a log floating on the water, but then Zebra saw him blink. Found you. That's another one that Zebra's managed to find. Snake thought of a really clever place to hide. It took Zebra ages to find him. So he's looking everywhere. Then Zebra noticed that uh, then Zebra noticed that the tree trunk looked bigger than normal. Found you. So he found Snake. So he's doing well at finding them. When everyone had been found, Little Monkey told some jokes. He knew some really funny ones. Zebra laughed so hard that his ribs hurt. You can see him rolling on the floor in laughter. Just then, Zebra's dad came to find him. There's a letter for you, he said, with a big smile. Can you guess who it's from? The letter was written on a big leaf and it said, Dear Zebra, we have arrived in our new home. It's nice, but I miss you and all of our friends. There is a friendly meerkat who is going to show me around. Please write soon. Love from Giraffe. So that was the letter that he'd been waiting for from his best friend. Zebra looked around at all his friends. I've got lots to tell Giraffe, he said. She sounds sad, but Monkey's jokes will make her laugh. Your letter will cheer her up, said his dad. That's what friends are for, said Zebra, smiling. Friends make you feel happy. So guys, Obviously, we're in a bit of a difficult situation at the minute, and for many of you, you're not seeing the friends at school that you're used to seeing. So please stay in contact with them, use social media, write to them on social media, just say hello, and hopefully it will make you feel just as happy as Zebra has felt from hearing from, from his best friend.